Jasmine and I was sent this automatic hair curler to try out for you. Let's check it out together. It has this really nice thick durable cord that even has the 360 swivel which I always look for in my hair tools. Now that I have it plugged in I'm gonna let it heat up and then we'll play with the settings. The barrel on this has a tourmaline ceramic coating which is supposed to help lock in moisture and reduce frizz. And I live in the south so that is going to be super helpful. All right so to turn this on you're going to hold the power button for about one and a half seconds and then it will tell you which heat setting it's on. You can choose between 320 degrees 356 degrees, 392 degrees, or 428 degrees. And those settings are just gonna depend on what works best for your hair. These buttons here determine which direction the barrel rotates in. So there's left and right. I'm gonna section off my hair and we're gonna try this out. So it says this works best for long to medium hair and I would say my hair is right in between there. But based off the description, it looks like I just put my hair in like this and pull it through there. And I like my curls away from my face, so I'm gonna hit the button to make it go that direction. Give it a minute. Right now I'm gonna... There we go. What's great about this is you can also alternate the direction of your curls if you want. It's not pulling at all. It actually doesn't feel like anything's on my hair. I'm just holding it next to my head. That's a really pretty curl. I'm gonna do a few more sections and I'll be right back. Now that I got the hang of this, it is so fast and so easy. You can even see the difference from this side to this side. The more I use it, the easier it gets and it really is fast and easy. I'm gonna do this top layer with you. Again, we're just gonna put this in here, suck the hair up in the direction that you want it to go and then hold. If it feels loose, I realized I could rotate it and it tightens up a little bit more, but it's still not pulling at all. Then I just pull down. And look at that curl. So pretty and so easy. I have naturally wavy hair and I don't have very short layers. So you can see even on my top layer, my hair is pretty long. And then pull down. And there you go. A piece this small is going to loosen a lot easier than a thicker piece. So you might have to just rotate it to tighten it up. And there we go. And then on this side, I'll just switch directions. Do a bigger chunk here. And it even does a great job on those bigger pieces. You put it in there just right. You can do your current bangs. You just have to push the button a few times. And they look great. I'm going to run my fingers through these curls and then we'll take another look. All right. And look at these beautiful beachy wavy curls. I did not expect to like this so much. It turned out so pretty and it actually feels like these are going to hold, which is amazing. I really like this. It was so easy to use and the results are so beautiful. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe.